what's up guys welcome back to nz toy reviews you're kicking it with kiwi cons if you're joining us for the first time be sure to hit that like button subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell to be the first to watch all my latest reviews with that out the way today we'll be looking at our third tech deck set by spin master i picked this one up the other day so without any other further ado man yo let's do this thing Before we have a look on the inside, let's have a quick look around the outside, starting with the front. Let's start with our board first. Now what's included, we get one skateboard, one display stand, one large sticker, and three small stickers. So this is the front done, let's check out the back. Just like the last set we looked at, this deck belongs to the 13th series part 1 of 2, and there are 12 boards to collect in this specific series. Sweet. That's the back done, so let's have a quick look now at our skate park set. So what's included, we get one signature board and one skate park. The deck is the Dwayne Fagandes and the park is located in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, the infamous Flamingo Park. So that's the front done, let's check out all the sides and around the back. So that's all our sides done and here we have the back of the box. The back showcases Flamingo Park and two other skate parks and the locations around the world. Nice. So that's the front sides and the back of our external packaging. Let's move on now to the inside. Now remember guys, all NZ toy reviews are aimed at adults. So let's grab out my trusty army knife and yo, let's do this thing. Here we have our deck, stickers and display stand, let's move on to the park. Now that we have our park out, let's have a closer look at our instruction manual. On the front, we have instructions on how to build our park, and around the back we have troubleshooting information and Spin Master contact details. So there we have it guys, everything unboxed and ready to go, so let's move on now to the setup. Here we are at the setup side of the video, so let's start building. There we go, everything put on and connected. I gotta say, this is the longest park I've come across thus far. I don't know how this will affect the demonstration, so this will be an interesting one. As you can see underneath, we have our rubber feet that keep the ramps from slipping around while in use. As always, a nice little touch there. Let's add on our last finishing touches, the Plan B stickers. And here we have it, the fully constructed and stick it up Flamingo Park. So let's move on now to the demo. Here we are at everyone's favorite part of the video, the demo. Let's put our park and GoPro into position and let's start shredding. Lego.
so there we have it guys that was the demo side of the video hopefully you enjoyed it as much as i did so let's move on now to my final thoughts first up the bad news for me only one thing really stood out and that was when i was trying to apply the stickers to the sides of the ramps they have slots on them and gaps that separate each piece so you can customize your park with other park pieces i mean that's cool but not when you're trying to make the park look like the one on the box you know what i'm saying but that's all the corn beef i have on this park moving on and now for the good news for me i really love how similar the stickers look to the actual artwork on the real flamingo park i was brought up seeing admiring and doing graffiti art so this is a huge thumbs up from me for sure nice little touch there spin master nice job indeed my man so there we have it guys our third tech deck set by spin master i really appreciate you watching and if you're interested in picking one of these up i'll leave a link down in the description and you know what i'll see y'all on the next nz toy review laters don't forget subscribe to the channel and check out my other reviews